what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so last night the south at the southwest film festival jordan peele's new film us had its world premiere and a lot of the reception has been mostly positive and i'm really excited to say that because i know a lot of people were excited to see how jordan peele was going to follow up with get out because get out got him an academy award uh it was nominated for a few academy awards and several other awards uh everybody loved get out it's considered one of the best movies of 2017 and ever since its release there's been like people have been talking about it people still talk about it uh, and now it looks like the discussion now is going to be with the early positive reception coming out of the premiere of us it looks like now what's going to be getting talked about more is is get out better than us or is us better than get out so in the film of uh, it's about these it's about this family that goes back to the hometown of the mother in the film who's played by lupita nyango uh her husband winston dukes and their two kids they go back to her hometown for like a getaway uh but there they come in they come in contact with these doppelgangers and in the synopsis for the film it mentions something about a past trauma that lupita's character has been suppressing and now i guess these doppelgangers have, might have something to do with that something along the lines of what i think that's what's going to happen the doppelgangers have something to do with whatever she suppressed that occurred to her during her childhood but yes the film had its premiere last night in austin texas out the southwest film festival for the most part all the critics are loving it people who were in attendance that were fans loved it it's been nothing but positive feedback for the movie and just like get out the movie currently sits at a 100 percent on rotten tomatoes out of right now i think it's out of near 30 30 reviews so far so it's on its way to becoming certified fresh whether it stays at 100 percent or not that's yet to be seen but regardless it's going to stay it's going to eventually become certified fresh once it reaches a certain amount of reviews then it'll be considered certified fresh but i'm excited to know that this film is getting early positive reviews and positive feedback because i know everyone is looking forward to seeing what he has up his sleeve next and i know jordan peele he had to have been a bit nervous going into this he he was probably a little bit nervous about how people would take this film so i know this just makes his his has to be like the best feeling in the world for him because coming from he has no background in the horror genre he's now put out what seems like two solid horror masterpieces of the modern era so now people are going to consider him amongst the greats they're going to start considering him amongst the greats he's got he he has to put out a few more before i want to start considering him one of the best i will say before i will before he gets considered like to being one of the greats uh like a carpenter or a craven but he's definitely going to start getting talked about a lot more and getting compared to them because and another thing that i would like to mention is how this positive feedback it all sounds it's all very fitting because peel himself was on record stating that to prepare for this movie he looked at some films of some of his favorite directors in in order to perform very well and avoid sophomore slump sophomore slump but sophomore slump is when you cannot follow up in the same way or deliver like your predecessor but he he avoided sophomore slump it appears with this new movie and us is going to be another modern horror masterpiece by jordan peele i'm going to go ahead and read some of the responses that are that were on twitter last night uh one of the responses was us is a house of horrors more terrifying but it's fun as get out and what it says about our divided country also shows that jordan peele is a new master of suspense the enemy is and maybe always has been us another person said us movie hashtag holy holy s what a horrific messed up f insane and overall amazing jordan peele has done it again with another amazing horror story every performance is outstanding i cannot wait to see what peele does next holy s another person writes well us was much more ambitious than i expected and dense one thing's for sure there's no moment of rest the ladies dominate the show lupita shahadi joseph and elizabeth moffs are excellent uh someone else wrote us movie just submitted jordan peele as the greatest horror mastermind of the decade a terrifying funny smart thoughtful movie with a phenomenal cast between between this and little monsters we're living in the year of lupita ninyango so that's all i'm going to read i'm going to leave it up here a bit for you to read the rest those are some of the thoughts that have come out about this movie everyone's talking about lupita's performance some people have mentioned winston duke's performance talking about elizabeth moss i was under the impression that based on the trailer that lupita was going to knock this out of the park and i'm glad to see that's exactly what happened here i'm really excited for this movie and i'm happy that jordan peele managed to put out what appears to be 
yet another very solid original uh unique horror film and it's again it's gonna have a social message in it he he says it's not about race i'm gonna wait to see it for myself i don't believe it's about race but i want to see what the message is i think he's come out and explained how a lot of what this movie is going to be about centers on how how society likes to recognize that we have a problem we but we don't like to talk about how we're contributing to the problem so i think that's what the overall symbolism is here with these doppelgangers in the movie I'm really happy that this movie is is currently sitting at 100% on Rotten Tomatoes and that Jordan Peele avoided sophomore slump. I'm happy for everyone involved with the project. Uh, I do plan to see it when it comes out in theaters in a few weeks. If you guys were at the film festival last night and you saw us, let me know what you thought about it down in the comment section below. What are your thoughts on us getting positive feedback for the most part as, as it's like early reviews start coming out? What do you think about that? Are you excited for the film? Let me know down in the comment section below. If you haven't already subscribed or turn on post notifications, in the description, I have links to all my social media accounts. You can message me there to let me know what movies, news, or reviews you would like me to cover in the future. With all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.